I'll show you how easy and effortless it is to sharpen a drill bit on a jewel tool. The jewel tool has a patented tool rest which makes sharpening super, super easy. Take the two posts, insert them into the two holes found in front of your jewel tool, secure them with the knobs included, and make sure that the tightening knob is on your left hand side and this can assure that you've got your tool rest on correctly. Now the tool rest has preset angles right here. As you can see there's 135 degrees, 118, 90, and 60. I am going to set this drill bit at 118. That's pretty a pretty popular angle. Now, this drill bit, as you can see, has been ground down on concrete, ground incorrectly, and I'll show you how quick and easy it is to resharpen it. Now, I didn't have to set up any jigs. I didn't have to make sure my angle was correct. I didn't have to preset a cam, make sure it's in right, all that nonsense. Look, turn the tool on. I'm using a 120 grit ceramic slide up right up against the ninja disc and sharpen. Done. Now if I want to bring back the release, you just sharpen right there. Wonderful. Now this side is completely destroyed and at a different angle. So watch how we can bring that back up. You can see right through the wheel, nice and even. Beautiful. You don't have to worry about any heat buildup and bring the heel back. There we go. Now, what you have is a beautifully centered, sharp drill bit. And it's not even hot. Look, that's my finger and that's my pinky. We reground it. Look at how centered the tip is, how even it is, and it'll cut like a charm. Now, if you wanted to get real fancy, you can go to a finer grade to our Trizac abrasives and even take that edge to a finer finish. But this will cut quick and easily and it'll work like a charm.